Now, in this same interview, detectives asked Lazaro about the day Casey ran out of gas in another subdivision not too far from her home. That was the same day that Casey stole those gas cans from her dad's backyard shed and about a week after Kaylee vanished. Now, according to Lazaro, he did not notice anything unusual in Casey's trunk, and he did not smell anything in there as well. Of course, detectives think that Kaylee may have been inside that trunk at some point, Jackie. Didn't Tony Lazaro help Casey when she ran out of gas at that Amsterdam? Scott? That's right. That was uh, just uh, about a week after mm -hmm. Kaylee disappeared, about two weeks, I'm sorry. And uh, Tony Lazaro uh, went to pick Casey up. She claimed she had run out of gas at this Am Scott. At that point, though, he says he never actually got out of the car. Casey claimed that her dad was going to come pick up the car from the Am Scott, and he tells detectives he never got close enough to that car to notice whether there's anything suspicious at that time. Still a lot of interesting details coming out today. Mike, thank you. And despite the reams of documents and photos turned over today, Casey's defense team doesn't feel the information has any relevance. Spokesperson Marty McKenzie tells Local 6 she spoke with attorney Jose Baez earlier today, and he said, quote, we are going to reserve comment on discovery releases until those times when the discovery is of some importance to the real evidence in this case. And as for the new documents released today, there are hundreds more pages to tell you about. There are coming up at 5, Casey's explanation of the switcheroo made in October when Casey switched vehicles on the way to turn herself in and what she told investigators during that ride. And then at 5.30, new information about the meter reader and how a map Roy Kronk made is connected to new forensics reports from the scene. Then at 6, we were learning that investigators got Casey's boyfriend, Tony Lazaro, to agree to wear a wire to get information from Casey's brother, Lee. But what did he learn? Stay with Local 6 and ClickOrlando.com for all the new documents released today in the case against Casey.